Well, we want to thank uh, uh, Morgantown for their hospitality. Um, kindness is always great here when we, we come. Um, as far as uh, it's always a tough environment, and uh, if, you, if you beat West Virginia, you're going to have to beat them. They're not going to give it to you. Um, and then uh, uh, God's given us a great platform. We want to honor them with it, and I thought uh, we really played well offensively for um, – <laughs> so here's what I was doing. I was going to go first because sometimes when I get up here, they don't ask the players any questions. And I want Jacoby to get a lot of tough questions. So save all the tough ones for him. Give me the softball ones. So anyway, that's why, that's why I came up here first. But uh, um, anyway, really proud of the guys as far as getting off to a quick start. We really wanted to do that. And uh, from the beginning of the game, I thought we really did a great job on the offensive end. Defensively, late in the game, uh, uh, West Virginia um, did a great job in uh, uh, um, making sure that they made things tough on us all the way to the end. And uh, I know Josh really runs some some good stuff um, offensively, so we knew coming in, um, especially now that he's getting – uh, his team healthy for a couple games. People sometimes underestimate once you get somebody back, you assume, well, he's back, and it really takes – it's kind of like uh, driving on the freeway. You get on the ramp. It takes you a couple games to get up to speed. Um, but um, they have a talented roster, and uh, I see them finishing strong. So you guys have scored well most of the year, but tonight – sometimes on the road, shots don't fall quite as easily, but – Tonight, you happy with the way your offense flowed? Yeah, most definitely. I thought we had a lot of good looks. The ones that we missed, uh, um, uh, normally I, I judge uh, uh, if I'm doing a good job. If, if we're taking good shots, that means the offense working. And, and uh, I thought we had a lot of good ones. And the ones we missed, um, to have uh, 22 second chance points, uh, we did a good job in uh, getting second chance points. Scott, ultimately, how important is balance to your team's success? It Six more double figures tonight. I think three with at least 18. Yeah, um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, sir. So uh, uh, I, I think that's that's uh, without Langston. Um, last game, uh, uh, Austin Sachs was our leading scorer off the bench, and um, I thought uh, Josh was a lot more aggressive tonight. Did a great job. And uh, uh, Miro and Caleb really did a great job moving the ball, playing defense, playing the right way. And um, it takes a team to win. And uh, uh, with with a balanced attack, uh, if you go into a, a game and you're relying on one person, if they have an off night, you're done. If the defense takes them away, you're done. Um, so it's great when you have a balance so that uh, uh, when it's not your night, you got people to pick you up. All right, all the tough questions for Jacoby. <laughs> hey, ask him about his rebounding, first of all. Yeah, I just, I just, that's all I'm looking at. I'm the... Jacoby, uh, you know, obviously offense is going to get attention, but your defense, because you had Raekwon battle a good bit, so just to enjoy that matchup going against one of their better offensive players, and how, how do you think you did? Yeah, uh, but first, first off, I want to thank my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, just for giving me the opportunity. Um, me just being a young guy, uh, these are big games and not a lot of people get to play in them. So just to be in this environment and play against a good West Virginia team, uh, away game, is just a blessing. But, um, yeah, uh, I, I, like, I like that matchup we was talking during the game. Um, you know, we were just letting each other know, like, uh, we here, we both, we both trying to score, we both trying to get the win. And um, he had a great game. How do you think you did, though, when you did match up with him? Yeah, I think I did good. I uh, was contesting his shots. He hit a couple tough ones, but for the most part, I, uh, I think I did a good job. Anybody else? Offensively, overall for you guys, I mean, again, you've scored a ton all year, this team as a team. Do you feel you had a good flow tonight for a rugby? Uh, yeah, definitely. Um, like you were saying to Coach Drew, our shots weren't falling as much as they normally do, but – uh, there was a point in the game when they were, and I think uh, that really got all of us up at our feet. But um, I think our offense was flowing pretty well. Uh, it kind of got down later in the game, but uh, we were knocking down our free throws so we could keep the lead. I mean, you guys have played, what, 12 big 12 games now. Uh, I can't imagine there's been a lot of them where both teams shot over 50%. Both teams are – or one team's over 90, another team's over 80. How unique – was this game tonight compared to the other Big 12 games you guys played? Um, like I was saying, it was, just a, uh, it was a different environment uh, coming out here. You know, the crowd was against the refs, and then 
uh, we were just trying to stay together as they were trying to make their run. So this was definitely a big game and a, a cool environment just to be in. Anything else? All right. Thank you all.